Marty Schwartz here. Gonna teach you this uh, cool little rocker, rock and roll song. Uh, we need three chords and one note be, uh, besides those three chords and a little lick. <clears throat> so the first chord is an E power chord. The other chord we need is an A power chord. We strum these two strings. So the E power chord is these two. A power chord is these two. Then we need a B power chord, which is still strumming these two. And it's that note and that note. Okay. Then that, that note I was talking about is going to be middle finger on the third fret of the low E string, which is a G note. So it starts like this. Two, two down strums on the power chord of E. Then again. Then middle finger on that third fret right there. So it goes two, three, four, rest of the note. Then we go to the A power chord. Two down strums on that. Then the B power chord. Middle finger again on that third fret of the low E string. Then it starts over. So here it is really slow. does that again and when it goes to the B power chord the second time through it's down down you can keep your first finger there but then you have to strum the top two strings down down so it's like B B E E and then E again so here's what we have so far power chord again. Then we're going to go ring finger on the 12th fret of the high E to the 10th fret on the high E. And you can pull it off. Then the 12th fret of the B. Then you can slide that down to the 10th fret with your ring finger on the B. And we're going to pull off to the 8th fret. So then when the verse comes in, finally, you can keep your first finger there, but it then becomes a B power chord. Then it's B, E, A, now there's no guitar. Then we're going to build up on that B power chord right back into the chorus that I taught you in the beginning. Does the whole thing, then build up on the beat. 